hey guys it's phase one with another video today um as of recording the misc expanse has been uh the concept sale has been released to um uh, concierge um right now so you guys will be getting it tomorrow in a few hours actually as of recording to this and um so what we're going to do is going to quickly take a look at it see some of the details that we've revealed on it and some of the images that they 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 pushed out with this new concept sale all right so before we get started i'd like to give a big 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 thanks to joshua waller for um being a member um of the channel all right much really really appreciate it bro i really appreciate that all right um so now without any further ado let's get right into it let's look at this new concept sale all right so refine your prospects missed expanse all right love this i really love the design of this ship it's, a, it's an industrial ship i'm not really into industrial but this looks like it's it looks legit man it looks like a real deal man i really like it you know so so now they're saying um upgrade your mining operation so introducing a Miss Expanse, a single multi-crew at the heart of both large and small-scale refining operations across the empire. The Expanse self-contained refinery system makes it industrial standard for accessible vehicular-based mineral processing, specifically designed to operate in tandem with minor vehicles like the Miss Prospector. The Expanse enhances at any very any serious mining operation by transforming raw material parts into sellable uh material on the fly right so that's going to be the strategic advantage of having an expanse in your mining operation all right so what you're going to need what what this is going to be is it's going to be the nucleus of your mining operation it's going to be the main hub it's going to be the one vehicle that's supposed to be prot protected the most because it's going to be essentially sitting still while you have prospect prospectors going out to find rocks and extracting and um, bringing them over to the refinery, uh, the, the expanse itself. And then the expanse will then refine this material on the fly and allow haulers to come over and pick up the uh, material to go and sell, right? So it's gonna be a continuous operation and all you need is, this will be there. I'm sure it's gonna run out of fuel, so you're gonna need Starfares to come um, and support every now and then. But essentially it's just gonna be a full operation you know and it's just gonna just be there in the field with the prospectors and the haulers all right so it's a, it's exciting because this is gonna add a lot to the game it's gonna be really interesting um or it's like definitely gonna get involved with you know large mining operations probably with multiple refiners and multiple prospectors and stuff like that it's gonna be cool i'm gonna be really um looking into doing this kind of thing with the org itself all right I just let you know if you're looking for an org um check us out phase one industries you can find us in the description below all right um so the key features so they're saying that um ready to receive the expanse integrated seamlessly with all leading uh contemporary mineral extracting systems supporting the uee standard mining storage pods using throughout the empire throughout the empire the the expanse efficiently efficiently ingresses raw material raw ore refines it and distributes sellable material into empty cargo containers oh okay okay so it okay so it looks like the prospector will drop okay so the prospector what it will do is it'll it'll go underneath the expanse itself and that there'll be a tractor beam at the back of it that's what it looks like right and the tractor beam will pull the saddlebags on the prospector um as soon as the prospector ejects the saddlebags and then it'll pick it up it'll take out uh whatever the material it needs from it and then it will give the saddlebags back to the prospector so it seems like these stay on it i initially i thought these will be removed um but i think this stays on the um expanse itself which is interesting so once uh the ore is within the ship i'm guessing is and, and it's it's processed and everything it would deposit the res the uh 
the processed ore into cargo containers. So I'm, I'm assuming the cargo containers that they're going to be, um, for example, the, the one that's coming out with the Hall A, the, the new car cargo containers or, or even the Argo Raft. So that's that's interesting to see how that's going to work. But it, it's looking really interesting thus far. I'm really loving the images of this. It's really cool. So like one concern, one concern that I have right now. So it seems like all of this is happening in space. So are you going to need to have the expanse in space? Because it seems like the prospectors are dropping the um, saddlebags nearby the expanse and they float and then the tractor beam picks them up as they get close enough. So if you're in atmosphere or you're on planet side, how, how would that work, right? You know, I'm assuming that you'll just drop them on the ground and attract them and we'll still be able to pick it up. So it seems like this will need to be fairly high up. Yeah, it looks like there's some there's some distance from the bottom of the ship. So, but we'll have to see. We'll have to see how that's going to work. But uh, I'm loving the images though, All right? So it says secure transfer. Uh, integrated tractor beam ensure uh, receiving raw material and distributing um processed or or entirely hands off procedure ingress full um ingress full parts from the mining vessels with each and with ease and run entire operation from the comfort of the cockpit interesting really so, okay I, so i thought so you could do everything from from the cockpit i thought you would probably need to leave and go somewhere else to actually like this, like I thought you would need to go to a terminal somewhere to actually do the whole refining, to at least set up your refining job. So this is interesting. So it looks like the cop itself is going to have some um, new screens. Well, different, different MFDs, probably bigger ones in order to accommodate for this. All right, so mineral processing refined. Uh, the heart of the expanse is onboard refiner. This fully integrated, self-sufficient system processes raw or more external min uh, mineral pods to refine sellable material, which it then distributes into empty containers waiting in the pod base. Empty containers waiting in the pod base. So, so in the pod base. So. Where is that? Is that is that in is that on the inside or is that the outside? Or is it the these these pods? Is it talking about these pods on the outside? Or is there something on the internal? Or is there like a, a bay on the in, on the inside of the ship that I don't know. I'm I'm curious to see how this is gonna work. Um troubled free off boarding. Uh, cargo containers full of refined ore are easily offboard thanks to the foolproof design and pod bay and uh, foolproof design of the pod bay okay pod bay again and tractor beams beams so multiple tractor beams okay unloading unloading significant volumes of ore for huge profit and move on to the next job is in no time interesting 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 Okay. All right. So to discover the expanse. All right. So the cockpit is right here. So these are the weapons. I'm not even. Oh, you guys can hardly see. Can, can I expand this further? Can't. All right. So so that's that's the uh, weapons right there. Ship access. So you access the ship through the bottom. Yeah, we know that. Um. What is this? So the refinery. Okay, that's at the core of the ship. The pod bays. Okay, so these are the pod bays. Okay, so it'll still be in saddlebag format. So how does, let's say, a hall A or a hall, you know, like, how, how do you transport saddlebags? Well, with a new cargo factor, we factor coming in. It, you're actually going to be picking up physical containers. So... I can see I can see how that that's gonna work then. That's fine. Okay. And then an attractor beam. Xi'an inspired tractor beam that makes loading and unloading pods effortless. Interesting. That's really cool, man. That's that's really, really, really cool. The ship looks really cool to me, man. I'm digging it. Alright, so it's gonna be 35.5 meters in length, 
height of 10.75 width of 21.1 and, and it's a it's a fairly big ship and it only requires one person to run it all right so it has six um six reactors for refinery reactors two weapon size ones and then uh 64 su of cargo and then it so it's eight by eight su so eight eight su uh pods and has a size one tractor beam interesting 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 all right so this is the gallery i'm, I'm assuming these are the same images we saw earlier i think i think all of these are all you've seen all of this okay so this is how the tractor beam is gonna work okay so this is it stowed tractor beam unit okay when it's out and then content extraction okay so it pulls it in it the pod connects and then it extracts the content from oh that's cool that's gonna be cool to see so this is this 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 device right here this gray device right here is the actual tractor beam and then this 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 right here is the actual extractor this right here so that's the tractor beam this is the extractor that's interesting I, oh man i can't wait to see this thing actually work that's really cool that's really cool it's a cool looking ship man I, I, i'm really digging it for real i'm really digging it i'm really really digging it man. it's a nice design cig just keeps making really cool designs man i'm really i'm definitely 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 digging this ship it's definitely a ship i'm gonna own but i don't know if i'll pledge for it though but let, let, let's move on all right, refine your prospects. So, um, Chairman Club, I'm getting the early access, of course. Um, yeah, so so these are the prices, right? So if you want to get it, this thing, uh, this concept in War Bond is 135, and uh, for for store credit, you'll get it for 150, right? They have some paint jobs for it um, for those that are interested. Um, all right, and then they have some packages with it too, so. Um, they call the MISC uh, minor pack and uh, a MISC minor pack. So war bond, I'm guessing, and then this is store credit. And there's a rough neck. What's in the rough neck? So you get an expanse, a prospector, a freelancer, and a vulture. Interesting. All the industrial ships. Nice, 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 nice. All right, so that's that's essentially it. You guys let me know in the comments below what your thoughts on the expense. Are you gonna get it? Are you gonna get it through pledging or are you gonna get it in game? Um, let me know how you feel about the ship, how, how, how the design is. Let me know in the comments below, all right? If you haven't already, subscribe. Leave a like on this video as well, all right? I will see you on the next one.